cutting, so it would be super funny. Which is a pair that's just getting in there. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Can, can, can I sit there and send you? Oh, it's too late now. I'll do it tomorrow. <laughs> No, smile, you weirdo. <laughs> Stay here until somebody gets on. If, so, what are we looking at? Are we looking at the other one? Yeah. But I like to look at the comments. Good morning, Dax. This is my son, Brooks. Good morning, Blake. Good morning, Joss. Joss says hi, Brooks. <laughs> hey, everybody, this is Brooks. If you don't know, Eliza, I don't know if Chris is saying hi. I'm pretty, I'm pretty popular. You are pretty popular. <laughs> Blake says hi now, too. <laughs> Count up the fame, guess who? Brooks is a famous rapper, also. It's true. It's true. <laughs> um, this, I'll type in the comment box his name. I have some. Uh -oh. What happened to it? I think. Good morning, Maverick. This week we are doing, I'm calling it Insects and Flowers. Bye, buddy. <laughs> Bobo Beats, so B O B O B T Z is what I just put. That's his music name on different music platforms. Now, some of his lyrics are not appropriate because he is almost 15 years old. But some of his songs, like one great song that dropped, right? It's oh, It's called Shimmy. So, and good morning, one's, Ella. That one's clean. Okay, Shimmy. By Bobo Beats. It's on different platforms and it's on TikTok, yes? Yes. And it's on TikTok, and I know a lot of people are. Um... Oh, did I go away? Because I see myself. Um, if you're on TikTok and you can pick Shimmy by Bobo Beats. He's also working on getting it to be a dance to it. I know it's super loud here. Okay. Um, we have a lot going on in our house right now. We're getting some new floors put in. Um, Sam's back there playing Fortnite, yelling. Brooks is doing his work right here. I don't know where Jack is. Is Jack sitting at the bar? So, lots going on. I keep freezing. I, you'll know I'm, it's perfectly fine on here. Hi, Devin. Um, so hopefully it, it evens itself out. Okay. All right, so like I said, we are doing insects and flowers this week. And this will be the first week that we're not setting up a background first. And the reason we're not gonna set up a background first is we're just, it's just gonna end up being a bunch of flowers and leaves with an insect on each one. And we might need to do a second one because um, the ones I did today are, are pretty big. So I don't know if I'll have room for 15 bugs. So um, what you're going to do is you're going to draw the bug and then draw a leaf or flower around it so that you start to fill up the page with brightly colored flowers and leaves. So that's why there's no reason for setup. So I don't want to draw all the flowers first and then try to fit the bugs on there. It just get harder to... Um, Harder to lay out. It's lagging. No, I don't know. It's very laggy. Okay, let's see. Okay, well, I'm just going to keep going. Hopefully, it evens out. And if for some reason it won't, um, then hopefully the, you can catch the replay, you know, because it won't be on that long. All right, so I picked three bugs today. And of course, the bugs can be any color you want, and the flowers and leaves can be any color you want. So it's a really fun way um, to create a fun, bright piece. Um, if you don't have TikTok and you have some other form of music, you can Spotify, Apple Music, 
Yeah, Google Play. Google Play. So if you search up, I know that Shimmy, his song Shimmy, is uh, it's clean, perfectly fine for all ages, and it's really fun. And it features Brooks, and it also features my other son, Jack, and Sam actually is the one who made the beat. So it's pretty cool. All right, so let's start. Oh, let's start with the first one. Sorry, it's super loud here. Um, first, we have a butterfly, and I know we've done butterflies before, or a butterfly before. I think we just did a dragonfly, but I don't know. So butterflies are large, um, have large, brightly colored wings. So again, you can do whatever you want, which is really fun. They are related to moths, which aren't generally as bright. We think of moths as being more like white or tan sort of clear, um, but I know that there are some moths that are clear. Um, and of course we know butterflies start as caterpillars, and then they create their chrysalis and they come out as butterflies. Um, and some butterflies migrate over long distances. Um, oh, I just lost the name, the name just, oh, the monarch butterfly. I know that second graders in Howard County learn about butterflies and how they migrate. Um, during different months of the year and um, Sam was supposed to have a field trip to the butterfly garden in Maryland but he didn't get to do that this year. And butterflies have been around for so long um, they've actually there's been fossils of butterflies over 56 million years ago. All right so we're gonna start I'm gonna make this butterfly sideways so you can draw it on a flower. So we're going to start with its head. Eye. And then give it these really cool antennas. Okay, and then you're going to do some erasing, but I'll just draw it in first. You're going to draw the body. Yeah. Sorry, sorry. Yeah. And then we're going to draw some little legs. So then, obviously, you'd erase. And you can cho sort of change the um, length of the legs depending on uh, where your flower is. All right, and then we're going to do some stripes on his abdomen. And then we're going to draw this bottom wing. And then you have a other part of it. And a bigger wing here. And then lines like this. I forgot to do this here. And then don't forget his other wing. Here's and that's pretty much it. And then you can, and I, you know, I added these two parts. Oops, this one and this one. But you can make that whatever you want. You can do different dots. You could do, if you wanted to add more colors, you could do 
got down. Okay, so that's our butterfly. And then here, I'll just actually show you what I did. So then what you can easily do is make a center of a flower right under him like this. And then add the petals. So then he is a butterfly sitting on the flower. That's why it's easier to do uh, the insect first and the flower around it. I still I think I'm frozen. I think that's what they're saying. I'm gonna keep going. So there's a replay. You'll be able to see it. Oops. All right, so the next one, I actually probably should have done these in reverse because the next one is a caterpillar. And we know that the caterpillar is the larva stage of what then turn into butterflies and moths. Um, and they are herbivores, so they eat their way through leaves, unless you're the very hungry caterpillar who eats his way through lots of food, um, but they generally eat leaves and they have soft bodies and they can be one millimeter, so super teeny tiny, all the way up to 14 centimeters. So they still don't get really big. And fossils of caterpillars have dated back um, 44 million years ago. So we're going to draw this really cute caterpillar. Um, I decided to make this one sort of like inching up, like it's moving along. And I drew this one on a leaf. Oh yeah, there is Hank. There he is. Hanky, what are you doing? He is laying there. Being sleepy. I'll pick him up in a little bit. Maybe after I draw the caterpillar. Okay, so we'll start with the caterpillar's head. I'm going to draw his eyes in. So there's his head. Yeah, I'm not sure what's happening with it. It's fine on my end, so I'm not sure what the deal is. Maybe it's Facebook is having some delays. It might be like instruction messing with everything. But they're not even in there anymore. Not long. All right. All right. So now we're going to add the sections of his body. And like I said, we're going to make him look like he's inching. There's his body. That looks good. Like it? Mm -hmm. A lot better than the last one. A lot better. So then we're going to do some lines on his back. Then some little feet. Bless, Bless you. you. 
And then we have our caterpillar. Now I was looking at caterpillars and they come in all different kinds of colors. We generally think of like the very hungry caterpillar. He's mostly green with some red on him. Um, there are some really cool yellow and black ones. And the one I drew is I drew a black stripe, like I made these lines um, black. And then I made them different shades of blue because there's definitely some bright blue caterpillar seeds. So have a lot of fun with the colors of your caterpillar. You don't have to stick with just a green. And then I put him on a leaf. So then I could just draw this leaf around him like this. And then he's a caterpillar sitting on a leaf. Just saw the pug. Where'd he go? Is he next to you, Brooke? Um, no. He was just here. Hanky, where'd you go? He's over here chilling by the toy box. I'm gonna get it. Did not want to get up because he was snuggling by the toy box, having a nice little snuggle. Look, he's not even looking at me. He wants to go back. Not even looking at the camera. So irritated. Can you look? Brooke's calling. Hey. <laughs> there he is. There's that pug face. Hey, go back and lay down. Go to the girl to some toys. <laughs> All right, go ahead. Go with your buddy. Here's Ziggy too. Ziggy, where'd you go? Come here. There he is. <laughs> okay. All right. Ziggy's down when he gets excited. <laughs> okay. Sorry, that was a little crazy. All right. All right, so now we're going to do our last insect. Um, and it is a form of beetle, but we don't generally call it a beetle because it is the ladybug. And it's also called a ladybird, and that's what they refer to ladybugs in uh, England as ladybirds instead of ladybugs. Um, so it is a small beetle, and they are 0.03 to 0.71 inches, so very small. Usually we think of them as being um, red and black, so red with black spots, but they can also be orange or even yellow. Um, and what we love about ladybugs is they are very useful. They prey on what are called agricultural, agricultural pests, so other bugs that eat plants or bother people, they eat. And plus it's also good luck if a ladybug lands on you. So we all love the ladybug or the ladybird. All right, so we're gonna start with an oval. So an oval circle. And we're gonna add its head off the top like this. 